this is Hayden Chambliss with your news source, Sports. There's been lots of talk and distress about spring college sports being canceled to the point where the NCAA granted spring athletes an extra year of eligibility. But what about high school sports? A week ago today, the Georgia High School Association released a statement officially canceling all spring high school sports for the remainder of the semester. That same day, Clark Central Athletic Director Jonathan Ward sent out an email to coaches, athletes, and parents informing them of the changes. The high school's head baseball coach, Adam Osborne, was not surprised at this decision. I'd be lying if I said I wasn't expecting it, just given how it you know, everything that's going on in the news and in the world um, and how school was going. Um, but it was still sad to get the final word that, you know, this is it. What he and many other coaches are concerned about is their athletes. For some, this means that they have lost a year to show college recruiters what they can do. Because as the statement details, a fifth year of eligibility will not be granted despite requests. There's some guys in the junior class, Rio Foster, um, I know he he has expressed interest in playing baseball at the next level. So, um, uh, you know, it, it, it's unfortunate that he has to, he misses out on this opportunity to showcase his talent. Coach Osborne did say his team was luckier than others because they got to end the season together and on a positive note. You know, we were fortunate enough to be able to end our season on a, uh, a, a over spring break where we took a spring break trip, the varsity did. So there is a silver lining there that we, we've got, we had a lot of time uh, uh, together. In addition to officially ending spring sports, the statement also detailed that no GHSA activities or practices are allowed until further notice. This includes tryouts for fall sports. Clark Central's cross country team is lucky because they take every athlete that wants to be on the team. Head coach Lee Patterson did say that they have had to make some changes but they are trying to keep everything as normal as possible. Staying in contact with the students because some of them are running track, some of them are doing so a lot of them are doing all different sports. But we sent an email out stating, hey, this is what things are going to look like. Um, this is unprecedented, but for us, it's, it'll be business as usual. You Although cross-country season is not approaching very quickly, Coach Patterson has given the athletes recommendations to stay in shape. Right now, we're just reaching out saying, hey, guys, we know you're at home, you ain't probably doing anything. So what we do, you don't need much. You can use a treadmill, you can use the streets or trails. He also said that his athletes have not given him a reason to be concerned thus far. I've seen several of my kids running. It's been kind of encouraging, you know what I'm saying? Like they're just out running. I'm like, wow, that's, 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 that's that it just makes me proud. You know? In every other time of crisis in our country, sports have been the constant in what has brought people together. Although the situation is sad, Coach Osborne says that he hopes that this will teach kids a life lesson. They have no idea how young they are. They have no idea how precious time is. So this, is a, uh, this might be a rare occasion where naturally they all get some kind of perspective on how quickly things can be taken away and how precious every every second and every opportunity is. Hayden Chambliss, Grady News Source.